James Sabalski for EA Sports. It is the road to the Stanley Cup, and it kicks off tonight. Both these teams look ready to go, as does the official. Let's bring it on. A critical game for both sides here, and we are underway. Shuts the door with a great save. Moves the pass in front. as the goalie hangs on. Kovacar is a star who can get his squad buzzing offensively. Dreisaitl's tape-to-tape zone ability is when he sends firm, accurate passes to keep the play going for his club. I'm expecting one of these players to make a big difference for their team before the game is over. Back to you guys. Quick feed to Kopitar. And that's just out of reach. Los Angeles with possession in their own zone. Working the puck deep inside their own end. And he feeds it down to Kopitar. Los Angeles looks to break out in their own end. Here's a short pass to Byfield. What a steal in his own end. Moves the puck. Denies him! Talbot's movements are outstanding. I mean, he gets to position so quick. He's athletic and he makes a huge save from the slot. We got a whistle as the puck's frozen. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. Still scoreless in this one. Los Angeles takes possession off the draw. Fiallo stick handling in his own zone. To the low slot! And that goes off the face of the goaltender. I don't think he had time to get his head out of the way, and that one hits his mask. You gotta give it to the quality of mass nowadays. If that happened a few years ago, ooh, that would hurt even more. LA's got the puck here in the open ice. Down the left wing, they gain the zone. Shot! Denies him in front. And the goalie covers up for the whistle. LA's gonna start with the puck inside the offensive zone. And that's deflected off someone in front. Puts to the paint, takes a shot. Takes a bump but still hangs on to the puck. Slides the pass over to Perry. Looks to pass it to Deneau. Puck moved over to Roy. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Deneau. Fires it on net, can save. He's on it tonight. Keep a hold of it after that hit. Oh, and that goes wide. Sometimes players get into those scoring areas. They try and get a little too cute, and that's a result right there, not hitting the net. Well, you can't do that, or you're going to find your way marching over to the box. Fading speed through center, and here they come on the attack. Extra attacker out to apply the pressure with the goaltender at the bench. Penalty coming up here. Fogel's off to the box. Two minutes for tripping. First chance of the night here on the man advantage. Scoreless game right now, James, but an opportunity on the power play. You have to find a way to convert. Move that puck quickly and open up lanes. Tries to get it out of the zone. Oh, great work getting the puck out of the zone. James, when I played, this was my bread and butter. I never saw power play time, but I saw a ton of PK time, and you knew when that puck was on your stick. You had to clear it, not only to get fresh legs on the ice, but now you could contest the neutral zone and defend the blue line on entry. That is the critical piece to any PK unit. And he loses control of the puck. Smart defensive play here in the open ice. Doesn't go as it's off a stick. And it's broken up by a nice defensive use of the stick. Grabs the puck. And the officials are calling a delayed penalty here. Looks like a trip. Oh, the home team is reeling here inside the defensive zone. The fans are nervous. And here comes the judgment from the official. The Oilers are going to be shorthanded because of a tripping call.
The Kings with a two-man advantage power play coming up. On a five-on-three, sometimes the puck movement along the outside is too slow. You have to have perfect timing with that. It can be too fast as well. If you're going to work the puck from high to low, look cross crease. That back door might be wide open. Special teams so important. Can they capitalize on this power play here with a face-off? And they take possession off the draw here at their own end. Moves the puck from off the bank pass. Oh, and he denies him on the one-timer. Wow! Quick pass to Fiala. Good reach of the stick to knock the puck away. Oh, tremendous save on the play! What an incredible save. No idea how he got to that one, James. And the shooter is absolutely stunned. What a stop. Tremendous pressure here in the offensive end. They're coming in waves. Such an impressive save. Love looking at this one again, James. You know that this goaltender is dialed in so focused when they're doing everything to get to the puck and keep their opponent at bay. Can they capitalize on this power play? Here comes the faceoff. Edmonton's going to start with the puck in their own end. LA's gained possession along the boards. Edmonton's penalty killers get a hold of it. Puck cleared from the defensive end. Picking up momentum across the zone here on the right side. More time off the clock as they grab the puck. And they manage to clear it. Tries to get this man advantage going from their own end now. Los Angeles steps inside. And a stick break set up. No room for that one to get through. A game of inches, and he puts it off the outside of the post. That's frustrating, James. The score is 0-0. Zero, zero, Control of the puck. And they continue to fight for that puck along the wall. Takes the feet at the back end. Oh, he scores! Aye, aye, captain! When we have a look at it, James, it looks like it's redirected, and that's just beautiful timing and get the hands away from the body, be able to get it to go the opposite direction of the goaltender. LA's got to be feeling good after getting that one, Cheryl. Well, they're certainly feeling good about themselves now, James. The body language has changed. They're on their toes. The confidence is lifted. It's a much-needed offense to get them within one. Good battle along the boards for the puck. Grabbed along the boards by Dubois. And he takes the feed. The Oilers have it now. Reaches out and uses the stick. 
Moves it quickly over to Yanmar. Great reach with the poke check by Roy. Los Angeles has it in the defensive end. Handles the pass. Look at this. They've got some bodies here on the attack. Big time stop. I really like this save, James, because he challenges the shooter who's all alone in the slot area. He turns aside a real dangerous opportunity. Well past the midway mark of this period. The Kings still trail by a goal here, but they are back into this one, only down by one. The Oilers are across the line and into the offensive end. Goalie with a stop. And we get a whistle as the goaltender decides to hang on to this one. LA's had plenty of good looks here so far in the first, but they still trail. Well, that's one way to win the draw as he skates away with the puck after the two centers were tied up. Here's a shot, and it goes right off his bucket. Well, this save was way more difficult than it looked, James. I mean, there's so much traffic in front that he's fighting through to see, and he finds the puck to make the save. Some last-second communication before both teams get ready to drop the puck here. The Oilers come up with the defensive zone draw. Edmonton's got it in their own zone. From the right wing, he moves it to the middle. Pass back to the point. And that skips out of the offensive end. Picking up ahead of Steve on the breakaway. Scores! And that's his first career playoff goal, and he'll take it. Uh, he will, James, because the playoffs is just a different beast. It's not regular season anymore. You want to be an impact player. You want to make a difference, and he does tonight. He's in on a breakaway, and some guys know exactly what they want to do, and some guys take what's given, but what a shot that is. He had no chance. win possession here in the open ice. Hyman's got the puck. With the blast, turns aside the slap shot. Wow! Way too much congestion blocks that. Taken by Mubarare. Oh, we got a tripping penalty coming up here. The officials were all over that. Well, look at this, Cheryl. Here we go. The parade is officially underway. It certainly is. And everyone in the building, you can hear the crowd just jeering with their frustration, including everyone on the bench, completely deflated right now. A non-stop procession to the penalty box for the home team. LA's power play unit puts their hard hats on as they go back to work. An opportunity to right the ship here on the power play after giving up that shorty earlier. Puck picked up by Fiala. With the pad. Takes the puck as the clock ticks down on the penalty kill. Looking to get it out. And they take care of business on the play. And they cough it up in the neutral zone. Shot! Oh, he gets all that one with the pad. Los Angeles moves ahead with the puck. The Kings looking against the half wall. And that's intercepted by Nurse. Puck clears the zone. Receives the pass. Oh, what a stick save. Skinner's got the puck, and he's going to hang on. Deneau's ready to take the draw here on this power play. Los Angeles wins possession right off the draw. And now it's grabbed by Kaliev. We got a penalty coming up here on the play. Oh, great core strength to hang on to the puck after that. Takes the feed up ahead and sends it just out of reach. The goaltender is quickly off to his bench to get the extra attacker out. There's the whistle, and here's the call. Well, that's a frustration penalty. I've taken many of those in my day, James. It's going to be the cross-checking penalty. Once you extend your arms, you're in trouble. Puck set to drop. We've got some 4-on-4 four four coming up. Not typically that we see four-on-four four action, although it's a lot of fun. You certainly know they practice it in practice. This is something that they're aware of. They know what they're doing. They want to possess the puck and try and create numerical advantage. 
And the traffic neutralizes that threat. Byfield's been brought down, and we're going to get a penalty here. And let's see what the definitive call is on the ice. Sometimes it's just a product of keeping your feet moving, and when you reach and you take your opponent's feet out, you're going to get the two minutes for tripping. Batten down the hatches. Things should open up here with a little four-on-four -on, -four on the ice. A few ways to play a four-on-four. -four. You can sit back or you can be very aggressive on the puck. But you have to make sure that you're aware as well. There's more ice out there for your opponent, too. Edmonton's on the attack. Quick feed to Dreisaitl. And he takes the feed. Look at this down the right wing. They're on the attack. Here's a shot. Oh, what a slick stop by Skinner. Gains the zone through the middle. Here's a short pass to Byfield. Grabbed in the open ice by Lizotte. Puts it on net. Oh, solid and save Jack by Skinner. Up. LA's got a small window to go to work here on this power play with the penalty expired. Power play set to roll on as the setters get ready for the faceoff. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. And that goes off a body. Sends the pass over. Taken along the wall by Nurse. McLeod's up and ready to get back on the ice. Gets a glove on it to make the stop. There's the whistle as the puck stopper likes to hang on. Here in the late goings of the period, it's all tied up. LA's won the faceoff deep in their own end. Works it across to Fiala. A little dipsy doodle and he loses possession of the puck. He got all of that one. No quarter given here as they battle for the loose puck along the boards. Enters the offensive zone from the left. Can't connect on the shot. And a smart heads up read to come up with the puck. From the left side takes it at center. Sends it down low. Quick pass to Nugent Hopkins. Scooped up along the wall by Moore. Here's a blast! Big save just as time runs out. Both teams are set. We'll drop the puck here. Period is in the books. The next 20 minutes is on deck next here on EA Sports. standpoint they haven't generated a lot and if they want to break the tie they've got to start putting shots to net steps into the offensive end a chance for court and it's blocked blocked away by Talbot slides the puck over and he'll swing around behind the net to play the puck picked up along the wall by Nurse with the puck inside the defensive zone We're still in the early stages of this period. The next goal could be a big one as we are tied. LA's got the win off that draw. Passes it to Deneau. Along the right wall and into the offensive end. Stones him in front. The Oilers have it against the wall. Slides it diagonally to Kane. 
kicked out. He's got it now deep inside his own end. The Kings will play it from the defensive zone. Here we go. Odd man rush here. Long jam in front. That's broken up. Quick pass across to Nugent Hopkins. Puck grabbed by Fiala. Streaking through center, they go on the attack. To his teammate. Unable to reach that one. Edmonton's got a hold of it against the wall. Gaining momentum along the wing. Good heads up defensive play as he extends the stick. Moves it up. Tries to get it to Kavrikov. Carries the puck through the neutral zone. Takes a shot. Great blocker stopped by Skinner. Moves it to Roy. The Kings working around near the back end. Moves it quickly over to Perry. Through the neutral zone up along the wing. Sends it in deep. Now over to Dubois. Knocked away by Bouchard. Can't maintain possession after that hit. Quick feed to Anderson Dolan. Grabs the puck. Here's a short pass to Anderson Dolan. Oh, and it goes off the outside of the post. The Kings bring another one off the post. It's unbelievable how many times they win it tonight. I mean, they'd be up by a bunch. Wouldn't be a tie game if that were the case. Fires it into the offensive zone. Picked up along the boards by Fogel. Oh, Stoyer! Stoyer! Possession of the puck. Shaves the puck away. Grabbed along the boards by Hyman. Oh, nice use of the boards with the paint pass. The Oilers played along the boards. Here's a shot. Blocked in traffic. Lewis has the puck inside the defensive zone. Here we go. On man rush. Denied by Skinner. Goaltender covers it up. We get a whistle to slow things down. We haven't even hit the midway mark of the period. Edmonton's got the momentum with a one-goal lead. They'd love to add to that. And he takes the pass. And that's broken up. Los Angeles looks to get things going now with the puck. And that's turned aside. Edmonton's got it in their own zone. And skilled use of the stick to poke the puck away. Slick feed. Scoops up the puck now. Great use of the stick here at center ice. Jan Marks moving the puck through his own zone. Takes that pass back at the point. Tremendous save by Skinner. Oh, stopped it. What a save on the play. And there's nothing technical about that. That is all about the will to find a way to make that save incredible, James. Quick pass to Denard. Right on target. Wow. Yeah, that's unbelievable, isn't it, James? That shot goes top cheese and just knocks the bottle off of the top of the net. It's bottle pops. 
Even I could have scored off that unbelievable feed, James. He's just able to corral that pass and put it in the back of the net. Past the midway mark in this period. We are all tied up in this one. LA's won the faceoff at center. Moves it to Deneau. Quick shot. Makes the save. What a reaction with the blocker. Angles it over to Hyman. Long reach breaks up the momentum. Battle along the boards. Yeah, that's a bad pass, and they'll be forced to do this over again. Directs it on over to Hyman. Carrying the puck deep inside his own end. Slides it on over to Dreisaitl. All alone! Not sure what happened there. Well, yeah, it looks like he was going left, then he was going right, but his inability to convert because he ran out of room. Puck scooped up by Eckholm. Takes the feed in the middle of the ice. Moves it quickly over to Dubois. Shot! That save! Oh, he got all of that one. Works it across to Bouchard. Shot! And that goes off a player. Big stop by the goaltender right in front. That's an incredible save, James. I mean, he's got presence in his crease, and he's also got a great glove hand, and he shows it right there with that save. Centers get set as they're ready to drop the puck again. Gagne's won the draw there on the attack. Here's a block! L.A.'s won the defensive zone draw. Quick feed to Kavrikov. Takes the feed. The Kings gain the zone. And that's knocked away in the defensive end by Echo. Taken along the wall by Roy. Sends a pass over. The Oilers have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Dished on over to Gagne. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Los Angeles looks to move the puck from their own end. They put the puck into the offensive end. Battle along the wall. Handles the puck. Here's a short pass to DeArnay. Big play inside the defensive zone. LA's going on the attack as they gain the zone. Quick pass to DeArnay. The Oilers will play it in their own end. Here they are on the attack. And that's broken up with a stick in front. Steps inside the attacking zone down the left wing. Moves it to Spence. He to the middle. Takes a shot. Stopped by the goaltender. Skinner's been dialed in right from puck drop, James. I mean, he's made the key saves that he's need to make, and it's all about for a tender managing the momentum swings of the game and the timeliness of the saves have really given this team an opportunity. Getting into the later stages of this period, we got a tie game. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. The Oilers take it across the line. And he gets in front of the slap shot to make the save. And the play continues. Sends the pass across the ice. He got all of that hit on the play. Sends one up to Kulak. Second period nearly in the books here. Edmonton's got the puck along the wall. Kulak's taking it from his own end. The Kings take possession in the defensive end. All alone! Who's a rising of the play? Uh, this is a great play by the tender to anticipate and get across to make that save. Here's a chance! And he hangs on just as time runs out. Well, there you go. 40 minutes in the books. All right, friends, go grab yourself some water, get hydrated, and then buckle up because we got an exciting third period coming up in moments.
Fans are buzzing. Teams are gliding into position here for the start of the third. Who wants that go-ahead goal the most? Here we go. The puck is dropped on period number three. Chance in front. Big time save by Talbot. Man, he was right on that puck. He knew exactly where it was. It was tight to the crease. He got out and challenged right away to make the save. And he makes that save as well. Well, he's been under siege, and I'm loving his compete level. I mean, he's making consecutive saves one after another. Lots of time left in this period. You can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. LA's won the draw inside the offensive zone. Now let's see what they can do with it. Oh, it serves up a little too sweet with that save. Looks like lineups are set and they're ready to get things back underway. Play resumes as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Answered the call there. Taken by Dreisaitl. Nice zone entry from the middle. Moves it quickly over to Hyman. Denies him in close. Puck is frozen and will get a face-off. The Kings get a hold of the puck in their own end. Pass to Turkoff. Big hit and that frees up possession. Slides it diagonally to Nugent Hopkins. Talbot's going to hang on for a whistle. The Kings win the draw. Takes the feed. Moves the puck over to Fiala. The Oilers get a hold of it. Takes the pass. Defensive zone. And he takes the dish. Here's a short pass to Perry. Moves the puck. Quick pass to Dubois. The Oilers have it from their own end. Here they come down the right side and on the attack. Moves it to the middle. And that goes off a body and a ride. There's the whistle as the puck is frozen up. Still lots of time left in the period. The Oilers have just had a little more offense than their opponents tonight. They lead it 4-3. Oh, love the defensive stick work there to poke that one away. Oh, that's a good hit. And he takes the feed. 
And that's taken by the defense. Sends it in front. Oh, he comes up with a stop. The Kings need to find a way to break on through here. They've had plenty of shots on net, but they've got to convert here in order to even things up. And they win the draw here in their own end. Edmonton's got a hold of the puck. Great heads up play with the stick by Gavrikov. Solid check to slow him down. Moves it to McDavid. Back to the blue line. Makes it look easy with the stop. Angles it over to Turcotte. Puck grab by Byfield. Hammers a shot. Oh, gets a glove on it to make the stop. All those tracking exercises when you're young come in handy when you're older. And this is a prime example. Look at him, Bob and Weave, trying to find that puck. He does and makes a save. Puck possession so critical in today's game. And the official ready to drop the puck right here. Puck scooped up by Gavrikov. And that shot gets caught in traffic. Taken by Roy. Edmonton's got a hold of it along the wall. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. To point blank! Spectacular stop by the goaltender. How did he hang on to that? The goaltender is very aware of where that puck is in that low slot area and defends his crease by getting out, being aggressive, and taking away any of the net. LA's got the puck along the boards. Scooped up along the wall by Kulak. Oh, here we go. This team knows how to turn it up another gear. They have done that here. Another big stop. And there's the whistle as the goaltender will hang on and give his team a breather. Face-off coming up here in the offensive zone. Well, they'll want to continue with the sustained pressure because the goaltender, he is fatigued. Los Angeles wins the draw. Through center along the wing. Moves it quickly over to Nugent Hopkins. The Oilers move it ahead. Centering feed. And he denies that great opportunity there. More than half the period has expired. Edmonton's clinging to this 4-3 lead. Los Angeles takes possession off the draw. Pass across to England. Feeds it to Moore. Slides the puck into the offensive zone. Out of midair, he swats it down to the ice. Sends it deep inside the offensive zone. Handles the pass. Down the right side and into the zone. Nice hit on the play there. Centering feed. And he elects not to shoot and will hang on to the puck. Skinner's got the puck and hangs on for a whistle here in this third period. Well, he's been one of their best players all night. A reason why they're leading here in the third, James. But it's not just about the save. It's about managing the puck and making the decisions when to hold on. Quick feed to Spence. Oh, and a misfire as that goes right out of the zone. Good, solid check, and he loses control of it. Passes the puck over to Kelly. Up along the wing. Gets the puck in deep. Edmonton's got the puck. The Oilers have it now. Works it across to McLeod. Looks to make a play over to Fogel. Edmonton's got possession here in the neutral zone. The Kings are in transition. And he maintains possession of the puck here. Slides it diagonally to Dowdy. Moves it to the middle. And that's stopped. LA's gained possession along the boards. Slides it quickly to Perry. Well, the game certainly isn't predictable, is it, James? As it's going back and forth, goals from all areas as players shoot from all angles and attack the zone. And that pass is redirected. LA's got possession of the puck. That's just textbook positioning to break up the play. The Oilers take it along the wall. Fires it! Here's a shot! And he catches that one with the glove. 
Who had the edge in Carlin Bain's mind? She's standing by with the answer. Kopitar's been buzzing, and he's been rewarded here. His name in the box score proves he's had a stronger night, guys. Nice poke check. Los Angeles gets a hold of the puck against the boards. The Oilers look to start the transition game. Trying to get back on the attack now. Here's a short pass to CeCe. Now he slides it up to McDavid. Edmonton's got it across the line. A little crashing and banging forces the turnover. Along the right side into the offensive zone. Passes it over to Dubois. Quick pass to Turcotte. Oh, spectacular save right there. Wow. Unbelievable. I mean, it was all but in, and he steals it. He part of that last stitch attempt to find the puck. Just incredible save, James. Just here in the late stages of this frame, fans have been treated to a fun one tonight. Lots of offense. It's 4 3. Receives the pass. Gains the zone along the right wall. Knocked away. The Kings have it against the wall. Moves it to Dowdy. Moves it to Kane. Gaining momentum up along the side. Shot! Looks, James, you have to have timing and an awareness to be able to get your stick on that rebound and then bury it. Not a lot of time and space available, but he executes perfectly. Teams are lined up, and we are ready to take this draw. And they take control of the puck here in the neutral zone. Puck picked up in the open ice. Turns it over. Moore's got it across the line. The Oilers gain possession in their own end. Long lead pass into the neutral zone. That's how you get North in a hurry. Fantastic stretch pass. And he had the answer on that play. Sits it in front. And he shuts down a great scoring chance there. Won the face off, and now let's see what they can do. LA's gained the line and into the zone. Huge play in his own end to come up with the puck. The Kings really need a goal here. They pulled the goalie and the extra attackers out. LA's got a hold of it against the wall. Roy's got the puck in his own zone. And as the final seconds tick away, listen to this place recognize a hard earned victory. Tries to get it over to McDavid. There it is, final horn sounds. We are all over here with this one. Look, a series is not won or lost with the opening game, but Cheryl, I'd much rather have that win. Uh, everyone would, wouldn't they? I mean, it's such a long season. You play it, but then when you get to the playoffs, you know, there's a different set of nerves. There's energy. You know, you're in a series that's do or die, and you got to figure out a way to get on top. To get that first game under your belt, just settles everyone in. And you've got the lend up now on your opponent. Real nice start. Well, the game might be done, but these playoffs are far from over. We've got more playoff intensity just around the corner. For Cheryl Pounder, I'm James Sebosky. Good night, and we'll see you next time.